We have so much to be grateful for in the life of the Diocese of Leicester and I truly give thanks to God for every church, every fresh expression of church, every individual who contributes so generously to the life of the Diocese. Training, development and support that I've received during my curacy has helped me to show God's love to this community and an example of that has been the work that we've been able to do in schools. Here in a rural benefice of five parishes, we're blessed to have three lay readers, one lay reader in training and a pastoral assistant. We are really thankful for their diocesan training and it's been a real pleasure to see them flourish. With the grant from the diocese, we've been able to find other grants that totalling 290,000 have enabled us to start reordering the church. This will not only make the building fit for purpose, but will also enable us to extend our mission and outreach. I'm now in the Deanery of Framland, a vast rural deanery of 65 churches around Melton Mowbray. For many years we were rather short of clergy, but in recent years we've almost managed to get a full complement. And it's tremendous now that we have that extra leadership among the lay people who have been keeping the churches going for so long. Diocesan Youth Support has enabled me to explore my vocation, be part of Bishop's Youth Council and talk about my mental health. And it's right that we should take time annually to prayerfully consider what God has given to us and how we will respond to that. So I encourage every one of you to be prayerful, to be generous and to be realistic in thinking about your contribution to what God is doing here.